Now I know I'm not the only one who's done this. You wake up on a morning that you don't work and you decide you want to cook some breakfast. So you get the bacon going, it's looking pretty fresh. The toast is done. The final thing you have to do is prepare the eggs perfectly. So you crack the first one, the first one goes pretty well. But then as you are cracking the first egg, the second egg rolls off of the counter because you didn't put it in the right spot. And officially, that egg has hit the ground. Now I know you may be asking, what the hell am I even talking about? Well I promise this is gonna correlate to the game that we're playing today. This is a game called Egghead Gumpty. Yes, this is a horror game about us running from an egg, but it looked so good, so scary that I had to download it. So hey, thank you so much for clicking on this video. Leave a like if you enjoy it, and are you subscribed? If you're not, feel free to click the button down below, and join my Discord. I have a link down below there as well. But whether you are involved in all that or not, it is so good to see each and every one of you. Go ahead, give me a high five. And without further ado, Let's play Egghead Gumpty. Oh, who could be calling me at this hour? You're in. Good. What do you mean I'm in? Good. Who am I, Leon Kennedy? All right, so we're on a rescue mission, obviously, from uh, Humpty Gumpty. Guide, collect 10 keys from blue presents to unlock the purple door. The purple door continuously appears randomly. Collect batteries from green presents to keep your flashlight on. When the icon appears, it means you are being watched. Failing to find your watcher has consequences. Hold right mouse button to use the UV flashlight. Putting UV flash at threats is the only way to survive. Bashing causes unnecessary sounds. Well, let's not bash away, but uh, it looks like we're on a... Uh... Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Look at this. Oh. Okay, so, well, how kind of us. Let's us uh, start with some presents around us. That's nice. Yo, I already forgot his name. Humpty Dumpty's older brother, the more fucked up one. The one that splatted on the kitchen ground, that's him. Bro, this game looks horrifying. I've already forgot- Oh, we got a body! Look at that, and it moves too. How fascinating. Yo, so this is like the back rooms, but like Humpty Dumpty's after me. This is pretty interesting. The game looks really clean and it, it, it moves around pretty well as well. Oh, yes. Give me it. All of it. Fuck, I press- Okay, that UV light's pretty strong. Holy cow. Okay. Oh, I'm being watched! Where is he? Yo, Humpty, where the fuck you at, man? Come here, you asshole! My eyes! Is that what I'm supposed to do? It's him! That's obviously him! Holy shit. What the fuck? Ah! Well, that happened. Holy shit. Oh, it's RNG. Great. <laughs> the presents are RNG, I just noticed that, but, uh, how do we survive Humpty? Gumpty, whatever the fuck his name is, I've already forgotten. Oh, the whole map is RNG as well? That opens up a lot of possibilities, I like that. So essentially, we just run around, collect these presents, and watch out for Big Boy. Man, he is spooky! We have three keys, we're doing alright. Mentally, I'm not. What do those black presents do? I don't remember it saying anything about the black presents. Are those like cursed presents that I shouldn't be picking up? Oh, I don't fucking know. I don't fucking know what I'm even doing. I just don't want to become breakfast to Humpty Gumpty. Gumphead. Oh fuck. Wait, what? E R T? Yes! Oh, that's how it works! Okay, well, we're moving on. Interesting. Very interesting. So we use these keys to unlock these doors. Or we could just kick the fucking door in. This is absolutely the back rooms, though. Like, absolutely. Oh, Gumpty! Fuck, where's he? Where the fuck's he at? I don't know where he fucking is. Where the fuck is he? Ah! Where the fuck was he? Gumpty, you son of a bitch. Oh, everything's fucking green now? Oh, Yo, this is pretty fucked. <laughs> if I have to say, everything's fucking green. What am I, in the Dr. Seuss book now? So we could also use a bobby pin. It's the fucking primary color man is in here, man. What is going on? Uh, T. Ah, uh, fuck. R? Uh, that didn't work. Okay, we should probably just find another key and come back here. I'm gonna keep this in mind. 
because we're coming back here once I find a present. Well, thank God I have unlimited stamina, but the stamina is not the issue. It's more like a game of hide and seek, and when he finds you, you're just boned. This is a terrible ass run. I haven't found one present besides the one that is given me at the beginning. Oh, Gumpty's gonna fuck me. Oh, fuck, there he is. Where? There he is. Get the fuck out of here, Gumpty. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here. That's what I fucking thought. Y'all, I'm officially lost in Gumpty's hellhole. Another door. Fuck. What if R? Oh. Press T when the screen is at its darkest? Okay. Did that work? Nope. It... Fuck! Open up! Where the fuck is he? Gumpty, where are you, you bastard? Oh, there he is! Get out of here! Oh my god, he's peeking through the ceiling! Holy shit! There we go. Kick it with my bare fucking foot! You don't want to fuck around with me, Gumpty. You'll be next, I promise you that. You know what, I'm sick of this. I'm just gonna start kicking all these doors in. With my very strong feet. Open up! FBI, open up! Ah, there we go, okay, finally. Got one. It only took long enough for one of those things to spawn. God, that took forever. And now there's a second one. Great. Let's go. So I completely understand the formula of this game now. So this shouldn't be too bad to actually like maneuver it. Ah, oh, the purple rooms. The back rooms is twin brothers. Two of ten keys collected? Fuck. That's a lot of keys. That's the main door too, the purple door. Huh? Where? Where is he? Where? There he is, you motherfucker! Get back in your hiding hole, go! So things are starting to open up. I'm finding more presents and uh, the area is changing quite a bit. So this is good, we're on the right path now. I gotta say, I'm so highly impressed with the level design in this. I think the level design really shines through because I have no idea where I'm at. The map is like massive too. A red pair is it, what does that do? What the fuck? It's a tape log. Number six. It's a tape log. Recorded and produced by Dr. Carter Green as selectively instructed by the ministry. This shipment of new inmates just arrived this morning. Lord! This shipment included roughly the same number of male inmates as last month's shipment, but a slightly higher female inmate count. Uh, according to the files received, less than 10% of the new faces are in for violent offenses, which is uplifting compared to the 25% that there was last month. All but one of the new inmates have yielded negative results for the mandatory pregnancy tests. The nursery here at Polbro Juvenile Detention Center is not equipped to deal with birth procedures. So transferring the outlier inmate may be necessary at future stages of the pregnancy. Oh. The resources we have, Polbro is sworn to try and improve the lives of all faces that might ever call the facility home. No matter what accommodations may need to be made for a better, safer experience. Oh, interesting. So this just isn't any random, like, hellhole we're in. Oh, very interesting. I love the lore. I love the lore. Okay, where the fuck am I? It's been a while since I found a present. Bro, the flashlight is so bad in this. Oh, great heaven! What? What? I fucking fell off the map! Okay, that that's a bit of an issue. That's a bit of an issue. <laughs> I just fell off the map, guys. Are you kidding me? Fuck. No! Where? What? What the fuck is going on? Oh my god. Where the fuck is he? What the fuck happened? So I really don't understand the whole lock picking thing. I'm pressing the T button whenever it gets dark. So uh, hopefully that improves with later in-game stuff. But fucking kick this door down, man. Put your back into it. Like, see? I fucking pushed it. Why the fuck didn't it work? Okay, where is he? Like, where is this asshole at? Where is he? I'm looking everywhere. There he is. Fuck you, man. See, I don't fucking get the whole lockpicking. You have to press it when it's at its darkest, but when you do, it doesn't work. 
Okay, where are you? You asshole, where are you? Where is he? Where the fuck is he? Fuck, man! Fuck. Where? Where's this asshat? Like, where is he spawning that I'm not seeing? Where? I'm trying to stay positive, guys. I really am. But, like, fuck me, man. Like this. Where the fuck is he? Is he spawning down the fucking hallway where I can't fucking see him? Like, where is he? Where is this asshat at? Where? You'll ever get, like, an itch that you just can't scratch. That's what this game fucking is to me. Like, I want to beat it. But man, it's making it so hard. In this run, I'm not going to kick any doors open. I'm going to try that strat and see if it works. Because, uh, obviously the fucking lockpicking doesn't work. I don't, I haven't gotten one damn lockpick right. I don't know if it's just a me thing or what, but, man, that's so frustrating. Okay, we got five of them. We're halfway there. I'm staying positive. Fuck! Are you fucking kidding me, man? Oh my god, you are absolutely fucking kidding me. That just did not fucking happen right there. That was such a good run. Why am I even fucking trying anymore, man? Why? How is it just gonna spawn him around in a doorway when I'm running at him? That's the biggest bullshittery I've ever seen, man. The game knew I was fucking doing well, so it decided just to spawn him in a doorway in front of me that I was too close to. I know that just did not happen. Humpty Gumpty fucking is ruining my mind, guys. Why do I just know that if I collect all 10 keys, he's gonna pop up, like, in some obscure spot that I'm not gonna see, and he's gonna kill me? Like, why do I just know that's gonna happen? Fuck you. I'm not falling for that twice. Fuck. Where? Where? Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Where the fuck is he? No! Fuck, man! Fuck! Where was he? Oh my fucking god, man! I was right there! Y'all, I am fucking trying, man. I am trying so fucking hard. But it's so fucking hard, man. And the worst part is I know I'm putting in all this work, but then there's gonna be some guy who, congratulations to him, but beats it on his first fucking try, and I've been sitting here playing this for an hour and a half, screaming my lungs out, trying to find this gumpty fucker. We got fucking seven of them already. And I haven't even found the purple fucking door. Fuck. There he is. Get the fuck out of here. I'm coming back to this area because I don't like the green area. The green area is not good at all. You can never find presence in the green area. Fuck, 10. Where the fuck is the door? I don't fucking care, I'll have 11. Where is the fucking door? Y'all, I need the door like right fucking now. Hold on. Okay, I need the door right fucking now, guys. I have had no problem finding it, yes! Come on, come on, come on, come on. Go, go. Yes? Did I beat it? Did I? Yes! Oh my god, yes! Oh, fuck me. Oh. <laughs> this is such an incredible dub that I will remember for the rest of my life. The sheer agony that it took to complete this game was... Ugh. So I know this game is really RNG based and I really like that because it changes the experience every time But it's so frustrating when you're running around for 20 minutes to find one present for him to spawn in a place You can't even see and to fucking kill you and then just to get a run like I just had where I pretty much was given the 10 presents right off the bat I even have to search for any of them except for like two of them at the end I spent more time searching for that purple damn door than I did the presence but I really did enjoy this game uh there's some things that it could work on it is a demo so I'm trying 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 not to go too hard on it the biggest issue I have with this game is the lock picking the lock picking is utter dog shit I'm just gonna be honest when I say that I was pressing the key at the darkest time multiple times and it wasn't unlocking for me which is incredibly frustrating it forced me to kick the door so many times that that he would spawn in places that I wouldn't see. Maybe he was down the hall. I don't fucking know. But it didn't give me enough time to find him. So I think tweaking those little aspects of this game would make this really stand out. I love the atmosphere. I love Gump D himself. is really, really creepy. But I'm so glad that I took the extra time to get through this game. It's a good game. I really do like it. So maybe I'll play the full release when it releases. Comment down below. Let me know if you would like to see that. And leave a like for all my pain and suffering, please. Pretty please. And thank you everybody so much for watching, and I will see you, my lovers!
in the next video.